That one just got stuck back there. Now, yeah, there he goes again. You picking on brother? I just pulled that out of the washing machine. I'm going to take it out. Throw it out in the sun and dry it. I got that at the Southwest Bomasta Conference. You guys going to grow up and win at the conference? Yeah? They're playing in a mommy, mommy crate. Which nobody's ever been locked in a crate. Oh, they want Wade. They have two of them. Two of them. <laughs> oh, he's laundry. To do. That is Callie. There are mommies. What's the other barn? I told you not to get back there again, and you did it anyway. I just got you unstuck. This couch is too heavy for me to move. Mm -hmm. I'll have to get Brene out and move the crate because the couch is too heavy. You know, you'd think that you wouldn't have done that again, but you went and done it. Look at you. Now you got your legs stuck. All right, come on. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's too hot to go outside and play, so we'll play in the house. Granny brought us the brisket. I just, anyway, why am I running two miles in the morning and walking? Mm-hmm. It tastes so good. You're biting me. Did you quit that? Did you quit that, little man? So this is White Boy. I think I called him Wager. Pretty puppies. What you got? Oh, they love the toys in the toy box. I should put the balls out here. Get some pictures. I do need to do your picture, sure. Uh, this is one litter, thank you, Lord, that I actually did do consistent pictures of. Goody and Bunny, I did not. I mean, I don't know if I had 50 pictures on there. Brene loves this. She loves the puppies. Now, don't bite her ears. Stop that. There's biting on her ear. She's letting them. Yeah, she's snoring. She's one of the best temperamented girls I've ever owned. But bull mastiffs are supposed to be bull mastiffs, and They don't appreciate what you're doing. They feel like they have the right to protect themselves. That's why when people call me and they say, Oh, aren't they good with children? I'm like, well, you can be if you'll protect them from the children. But if you want a dog your kids can roll in the floor with, I suggest you get a Labrador. These are working guard dogs. They're not just watch dogs. Sumo wrestling. Oh, that white boy is a pretty boy. Now you went behind the... Come back out. They've drug a stuffy into the crate. Oh, that's one thing. This floor is, I mean, it's not wet, but it's a little slick, and that's very <clears throat> footing in the whelping box should be, sorry, the whelping box, it should be really not slick. It should not be slick. You don't want them slipping. Do not want them slipping around. Make him mad, he's gonna give you a whooping. And you get that tooth in my toe. Oh, migrating to the creek. So they're on another part of this building where they can go out a doggy door, and they are doing marvelous. Now they haven't pooped inside, I don't know, it's several, several days. Sometimes they still pee, they don't poop inside. 
Hey, baby. I put a new collar on you, so all you can do is scratch. I know. This is going to be a fawn boy. Mm -hmm. Hey, baby. I should email those people that are coming. Hey, baby. Pretty, pretty puppies. Can't wait to see them on the table. He doesn't like this new collar. Hi. Hi there. So they'll probably pay, play another five or ten minutes and then they'll start falling asleep. That is a beautiful puppy. Oh, careful. You're going to get stuck under the door, silly goose. I don't know why Tim turned it that way and didn't just leave the opening. Ah, don't you get back there again. Back her up, mister. Well, that was you that was stuck a while ago. Did you see that puppy chewing on her ear? Poor Brene already has a hole in her ear. Posh bit a hole in her ear. It's true. She did, over a bone. Tanya said yesterday, or not before last, they butchered a bull, a huge bull. was fighting with another bull and died. Actually, the other older bull broke his leg in two. In two. I know, it sounds painful, doesn't it? Oh. Probably bring me some bones. We haven't had any. We have not done a count. Wow, well, we got a call a couple days ago, but Tim said his back was hurting. He didn't know how fresh it was. Yeah, my two girls, aren't they lovely? Willow, I don't know, I may name the other one Rose after her mother. It's funny walking down our road, walking down our dirt road, Granny has, through the years, planted all these beautiful wild roses. We have pinks and don't really have any reds, but they're not just a, like a, a real wild rose that just has one ring of petals. Now these are full. So there's whites and all different colors of pinks. So I was thinking about, if I named this road, I would name it Wild Rose. Hi. Ah, road. Say hi, you're on candy camera. My goodness, it's puppy town in here. It is, it's too hot to go outside and play daddy. We yeah. gotta come in here and play. They're winding down. I'm gonna put them up in a few minutes. I tasted the brisket, it couldn't be any better. I can't find it. I come in here looking for it. It's in, I covered it up with a fresh, clean towel. It's still warm. It's on the counter? Yeah. Okay. See, he wants oh, to yeah, win the Bullmastiff Specialty, the Southwest Bullmastiff Specialty. He says, I'm going to win. What's the play in the electric? I'm going to win the specialty. I'm going to win. I'm going to. Leave electrical stuff alone. This is a life lesson. <laughs> Just pull that out of there. Don't mess with it. Well, then he'll lick the socket. Mm -hmm. I'll come have lunch with you. Let me put these guys up. Okay, I've got uh, 200 pounds of chicken out here I've got to unload. Awesome possum. I put more water in there. I have a feeling we're gonna get a cow and we're gonna need it. Okay. But I mean, if you don't have room for all the chicken, I need to clean that chicken juice out before you put any in the refrigerator. Five boxes of chicken oh. will last us five days at I know. the most. I know. Okay, you guys, you gotta let me out. No, Daddy, don't leave. Don't leave us.